everybody. So good to see you again today. I'll be watching the reaction video to the GOAT, the, one of the songs of Sito Mosavala with Vazir Patar Sugh Sanghera from Mo's Tape. This song, one of the biggest albums ever in the Punjabi industry, as most tape is almost near to its end. Situ Mosavala dropped the 22nd track on the album titled Goats, and the song is going to keep your spirits up. But the disappointing fact is that it's the last second song of the album. Only one song remains, and the most tape will be officially done. Whoa, but like he put like so many songs in this one. The song Goat has the music of very talented Vazir Patar, who has previously featured in most tape as the music producer in the song Malva Block. The music video of the song is very evidently directed by Suk Sanghera. The quality of the video is enough to tell you who's the man behind it. Whoa, cannot wait to see this one. Do you know in which city was this music shot? Actually, it was Dubai. And the money that has been put on the song is unimaginable. The locations and the costume have been very smartly selected, keeping in mind the color theme of the song. Situ Mosavala looked like an obsolete killer in the song, roaming on the streets of his shooter gang. He wasn't joking and was a driller. Whoa. <laughs> I don't know if you know it but like some of the musicians they like don't write the text to their songs and I and they like you know have just like the lyric list that do it for them they just tell their thoughts but actually like Seto Masavala he not only sings the song but he's like the perfect lyric list too and he like chooses the word to his songs actually that's really special and that's the thing that we really have to admire. Mosavala has not just performed in India but as well as he performed also like in Canada and like in other countries too. His like Punjabi debut film was the Yes I'm Student which was produced under his own production house Jet Life Solutions while it was directed by Tanvir Sain, Jackpal and written by Gil Ranta. Whoa. watch the video and check this song out. I'm pretty excited for this one. Nice. Wow, what a beautiful city of Dubai. Oh my gosh, this is our hit city. I've never seen him like this. Plenty of like really good chords. But this one I can truly agree that it's like the best Punjabi song I've seen. Oh my gosh, the dogs. <laughs> so cute. But it's really like the killer song. It's like really sinister. Oh In this song, I'm really afraid of him. But he's very selfish. Like, special in what he's doing. Like, his songs are like totally different from like normal songs. Like all the Indian singers, really nice car and beautiful modern Dubai. Wow, she was really beautiful. Oh my gosh, she's so sexy on the scooter. Motorcycle, actually. Like the car race is like the, so many fast cars. <laughs> the aeroplanes too. Wow. And our beautiful city Dubai. And I really love his outfits in this song. They're like totally matching with like the beat of this song. Ooh. It's a desert or what? But he must like got your heart in this song. 
Like normally his songs are like most of the countryside songs or something like you know. At least like you have their like some countryside views. But like this one, the dogs that are also like very frightening. Like he's also like very powerful and strong in this one like so much. And like he's feeling like so confident like singing his songs. And like he's feeling like everywhere, like the whole beat of the song so much. And like it's so grateful of him that like he's writing like all the text to his songs. Like I really didn't expect that actually. No, but he's like really irreplaceable in like Punjabi industry. Wow. It's like totally guys fans. <laughs> Boom. Sashikal ji sarano main thoda apna Siddhu Moose wala je tuhanu mera eh gana vadiya lagya ta make sure subscribe my official YouTube channel Siddhu Moose wala because bahut cheezan ne jo haje on the way ne. Wow, actually this song was like totally different from the song that I heard like from Sethu Mosevala like this song was really something special like he was looking like very sinister and like frightening but like all over like his like the fast cars and like you know the beautiful city like the beautiful views were like really making this video so amazing and also like the text of the song is like really nice what I love about him is that like he's like totally honest like with his fans and like he's not pretending to like be different person that than he is he's like you know showing just all the emotions and like in the text he's writing like totally the feelings that like he has now and the text goes like I have bought a car with my due money honesty money and I drive in it but my opponents are jealous of me and consider my honestly earned money as fraud yeah this would be like actually all, all the time the haters they will always like consider you as like even though like you're doing like a really great job like in Punjabi, Punjabi industry is a real god and like yeah they will hate him because they want to have like actually the same things as he like reached by his like hard work so yeah like keep going <laughs> fingers crossed for you the police in your city calls me a thief but the boys of your locality consider me a goat greatest of all the time okay so that's the title of the song this is also like pretty interesting because like we can truly say that like he's the greatest of the time like actually like he did a lot he's like on the peak of this industry and it wasn't like so easy for him because like at the beginning was when he was creating his first song he didn't get like any help actually and like it was pretty tough for him because like you know he was also like so young and like at the beginning like most of the like artists they get like the lyric list or like at least like they get some help but like he achieved like everything on his own without anybody's help identity was actually made by him so really well the text song goes like the slayer group works with me but i'm like the diamond at heart but my dates are bad yeah, like he's a very good-hearted one and like like obviously like it's better to show like the exact feeling not like something that like you would want to be actually but like also like his haters like he has really a lot of haters that's why like cre he created like one of the songs i'm not sure whether it's just one but for sure one for the haters and actually like I guess like it was like a controversial stuff because like not many of the artists like do so like maybe like behind the lines like it's not you know it's like not written for them but like it's to under just to understand but like this one was like totally just written for them like, he wanted them to understand that like he's like also like against them has a very strong personality till like most of the like artists once they have like so many haters like as he got they like fall into depression or like are on drugs or something but like he just writes like when we cry we wipe away our tears with our hands Situ is ready for any challenge actually and that's what we see in like his songs he's like never giving up just going forward like you should never like look at the people that are like you know they'll always exist and like you just have to keep going and like show yourself that like you can do like best actually like my beloved quote of him it goes like if they're talking behind your back it means you're ahead of them and that's like really true like most of the people like the haters they just like envy that like you reached like such a big peak like you're so successful and like got so famous even though like there were like so many people that were like disappointing you and trying to like drag you down like you should never like fall for this actually because like once you like start looking and thinking about those people you'll have like so bad time in your life and like he never did 
actually. He was like, you know, trying to like overcome it. It like couldn't have been easy actually because like with so much hate, like nobody wants to deal with facts actually. But like, yeah, it happens like uh, everywhere, like especially like in the influencer world and like the artist world a lot, I can imagine. Thanks so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe and comment my channel. Please let me know which upcoming videos you want to see next. Take care. Bye. Have a nice day. Thank <laughs> you.